Good day everyone. Welcome to our stoichiometry 2 class. This is Gifted Brain aka Saizu, first in Africa, sixth in the world. In our stoichiometry class, we are concerned here with comparing various mole relationship. Yes, we get the mole from one relationship and use that same mole for to obtain another quantity. Let's take some examples this moment. Example 1. Uh, calculate the mass of an ideal sodium carbonate 4 Na to CO3 present in 300 cm cube of 0.1 mole per dm cube of the solution. Here, we have to get the mass of sodium carbonate 4 And one relationship that helps us get uh, the mass is, is mole mole is equal to molar ma uh, mass sorry over molar mass this relationship relating mole and mass and right, then obviously mass since we have to get mass mass will be equal to mole on cost multiplying mole times molar mass the question here is not one that uh, finds it difficult to get it's molar mass because the molar mass of N to CO3 can be gotten. Molar mass of N to CO3. Molar mass of N to CO3 is equal to sodium is 23 times 2 plus carbon is 12 times 1 plus oxygen 16 times 3. So at the end of the day, this will give us 106 gram per mole. Yeah. So the, to get our mass, our mass, it is mole multiplied by 106. But the question here comes, the question here is what is then the mole? These are some of the psychometric questions will come. But writing the question, you are giving some further information to get your mole you are giving 300 cm cube of 0.1 mole per dm cube the 300 cm cube stands for volume and the 0.1 mole per dm cube stands for concentration of the solution so we understand that this is the solution and then we can get mole from a solution it is the mole we get from this solution that we come and use to get the mass how do we get the mole here mole is simply concentration multiplied by volume and so, what is the concentration? It is 0.1 multiplied by what is the volume? And the volume is 300 cm cube, but remember we have to convert to dm cube. So that will give us 300 all over 1000. And this will be 0 0.3. So I will put my 0 0.3 here. So obviously, the mole is equal to 0 0.03 mole. So we've gotten our mole now. We now come and use this mole in this relationship over here, over here, to not get the mass. So, so most documentary questions will come in this form in what we are doing today. So what is then the mass? The mass will be equal to the mole, which is 0 0.03 now, multiplied by 106. And here we have 3.1. 8 gram example 2 example 2 here we are asked to evaluate calculate the number of Na to CO3 particles present in 300 cm cube of 0.1 mole per dm cube of the solution a quite an easy question one we are familiar with if I'm to get number of particle first of all I come to relate what what is uh, uh, relating I come to uh, uh, write a formula of what is relating mole and number of particles. Mole is number of particles. Number of particles. All over 6.02 times 10 raised to power 23. Yeah, this is the relationship. So, hence, on cost multiplying, number of particles. Number of particles. Number of particles. Is equal to mole times 6.02 times 10 raised to the power 23. 
yeah this is what uh, we will use to get our number of na to co3 particle so now the problem here becomes again how do i get the mole once you, they ask you this kind of question to get number of na to co3 particle just not right see in that same question you'll be giving further information to get the mole here the formula information we're giving is 300 cm cube of 0.1 mole per dm cube we've worked on that in our example one to get mole from that we use concentration times volume and when we did that our mole gave us the mole gave us 0 0.03 so obviously i'll be using that here so number of na to co3 particle number of na to co3 particle particle is equal to 0 0.03 mole multiplied by 6.02 times 10 raised to power 23 and then our answer is 1.806 times 10 raised to power 22. Thank you. Example 3. For this, we are asked to calculate the volume of 0.25 mole per dnq solution. If it's a solution, if I'm to get my volume, I first of all write the relationship between mole and volume in a solution. We have the mole is equal to uh, concentration multiplied by volume so obviously volume if i make volume so a formula volume will be equal to concentration concentration all over mole yes this is what i need to get my volume because for a solution but the next question comes in mind the concentration is given to me as 0.25 but again i don't have the mole like i said earlier further reading the question will give you the relationship for how to get your mole here we are told that is an acid that issue that the hso 4 still contain a mass of 4.5 gram of the raw acid so here i am giving mass which for my mass i know that i can relate mass and uh, mole that uh, uh, mole also also the mole mole is equal to mass all over molar mass a quick one because of our time what is the molar mass of h2so4 hydrogen is two so just say one times two one times two plus sulfur is 32 so just say 32 just by multiply by one because only one sulfur is there plus oxygen which is 16 multiply by four on evaluation uh, we have uh, 98 gram per mole that's the molar mass so i will simply say that my mole here will be mass given to me 4.5 gram all over molar mass 98 yes if we do this right we will have 0 0.046 mole so i've gotten my mole now this is the mole i will now use to get the volume so at the end of the day at the end of the day my volume my volume is equal to concentration 0 0.25 all over mole 0 0.046 and this will give us 5 point 5.43 dm cube example 4 and this is quite an easy one calculate the volume at stp if i'm to get the volume at stp i just have to have my relationship and uh, that uh, at stp mole is equal to volume over 22.4 okay so at the end of the day i can say my volume is equal to mole multiplied by 22.4 so to get my mole the further information is given there 8.8.0 8 gram of uh, booming vapor and so if that's what we have i can get my mole okay so to get my mole is mass over molar mass the mass is 8 all over 80 so 0.1 and using the 0.1 i i can get 0.1 times 22.4 and that gave me 2.24 dm cube thank you